Hey guys, so on today's video, I'm going to be doing an inspired look for you guys. I'm going to be recreating Mila Kunis's brown, golden brown, smoky eye that she does on a lot of red carpets. I thought I would recreate this look because I also like to do smoky eye looks on my eyes, especially at night when I go out, because um, I just think it complements brown eyes really, really well. I don't want to talk so much in the intro, so why don't we just get on to the tutorial. So the first thing I'm starting out with is a concealer slash highlighter pencil and I'm applying it along my brows and then I'm also applying it onto my lid just to even it out um, and I'm blending it with a makeup sponge and this also helps to make your eyebrows look more groomed and perfect. And then I'm going in with my Lorac Pro palette. I'm using a medium brown shade in the color Sable and I'm applying that to my lids. After that I'm going to take Taupe from the palette which is a lighter brown color and I'm applying that into my crease. After that's done, I'm taking Espresso from the palette, which is a darker brown color, and I'm using that in my outer V area, and I'm just kind of shaping the outer V, and then I'm also um, adding as much as I'd like to intensify it, however much I want to. Afterwards, I'm going to take this metallic golden brown color from this palette, which is no longer available, um, but you can find a similar color in the Naked 2 palette, and I'm applying that over my lid just to make the look more metallic. After that, I'm using the other side of that brush, and I'm going to take this golden eyeshadow. It's really, really pretty, and I'm applying that into the inner corner along my bottom lash line, and then also dragging it towards the middle of the lid. Once that's done, I'm going back in with the Espresso color, that dark brown color, and I'm applying it to the rest of my lower lash line and blending it through. To kind of smoke it out a bit, I'm going to take my crease brush and I'm going to basically smoke out the lower lash line. Once that's done, I'm going to use an eyeliner and I'm just going to place it into my waterline for a darker, more dramatic look. Once that's done, you can apply your concealer. I'm using the same concealer pencil and I'm just applying it along the bottom just to kind of clean up the look. And again, I'm going to blend it out, but I'm using a concealer slash uh, blending brush that I really, really like to use and I'm just blending it out with that. Once that's done, I'm going to go in with my liquid liner and I'm going to align my eyes. Once that's done, I'm going to take an eyelash curler and curl my lashes. After that, I'm using a lengthening and volumizing mascara, any kind will do, and I'm just applying it to my top and bottom lashes. And then this is a part where you can also apply false lashes, but I'm preferring to skip that step just because I hate having to apply false lashes. But now we're going to go on to the face makeup. I'm taking a contour color, which is just a dark brown color, and mine is a matte blush. And I am applying that to my cheekbones and then I'm blending it out with a buffer brush. After that, I'm applying a peachy pink blush to my cheeks. Once that's done, I'm taking a golden toned highlighter. Um, this is actually from a NARS palette. I forgot the name of it, um, but it's really pretty and I'm just applying it over that blush and then to the areas that I want to have a golden highlight. Afterwards, the lips, we're going to go ahead and line and fill them with a nude colored liner. And then you can either keep this look matte or you can apply a gloss and I'm just applying a golden gloss um, over the top of that just to kind of give it um, a little bit of a fuller, more plump look. So as you can see, I'm just applying the lip gloss in the middle of my lips and then just kind of um, spreading it throughout. <laughs> After that, the look is complete. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you guys think as usual in the comment section below. Hey guys, so on today's video, I'm going to be doing none other than the boyfriend tag, finally, because I know a lot of you guys have been wanting to see it. 